So now I'm gonna take you down this really popular street in Asaksa. So let's go. A lot of people take pictures here. And under. <laughs> <laughs> and then once you get past the gate, there's a whole bunch of stores. <laughs> and like you'd think that they'd be really like old and traditional, they're not. They're not that old and traditional. So you get a lot of souvenirs, a lot of snacks, um, pretty modern stuff too, but like a mix with the tradition, so it's really cool. Do they have cosmetics? <laughs> and it always smells so good. You can buy kimonos and stuff. There's a lot of souvenirs here. I think I got one here one time. I think I did. <laughs> this place has always been popular. There's always a line here. <laughs> but it's basically just a street with a lot of stores. You can buy your street food. There's a dove. <laughs> oh, there's ice cream. We all like ice cream. And there's always traffic. <laughs> but it's actually one of the more not as crowded days. So. That's good. I know y'all can't travel here, so <laughs> There's a lot of stuff. And a lot of people. I don't think I've even gone through every store. I've been here a couple of times, but I have not gone through every store yet, so it's a challenge. There's a lot of them. Dude, I just want to eat everything. <laughs> Those make really good snacks. Everything's adorable, as usual. Nothing's new. I'm not sure what this store is, but I can find out later. <laughs> I feel bad for people who like live here because like, like living in a touristy area, I feel like I could never be able to do that. I would be like, I hate tourists. <laughs> These fans, those are really pretty. I have a couple of those. You can get your fancy shoes. And you have to get the dog pillows. You have to get the dog pillow. I want a dog pillow. Someone get me a dog pillow. I feel like I'm supporting small businesses when I shop around here too. So that's also really exciting. Because it's all very local and very, you know, traditional. So it's nice. Yeah, any of these stores would make really good souvenirs for your friends back at home. So I recommend this street. You can't miss it. Everyone's here. <laughs> it just smells like food. It is more crowded than usual though, I feel like. I did, a, I did, I did think that with like Corona and stuff there would be that many people but we actually just released our emergency, state emergency thing, so now there's lots of people. And once you make it past everything, you go straight to the temple. Well, there's a person on the ceiling. <laughs> Thank you.
The streets are also insanely clean as you can see. There is not like any trash, which is insane to me. Everything's so cute. Even the people. <laughs> Like just being here makes me so happy thinking of all of the different people and like you know they're working and they look so happy and they're being tourists and they're taking pictures and it's just really good vibes we like that we like that oh i love it people <laughs> More souvenirs. <laughs> but as you can see in the distance, we're making it to the temple. So we're almost there. And it gets really crowded because everybody wants to take a picture in front of the temple. I have not been here with this many people in a long time. So it's actually really exciting to be like, oh, we're like getting close to normal life again. Oh, that's really pretty. I like her. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, we made it.